Just hold me tighter, please. Make me stop seeing my brothers in my mind. It's okay. I love you. I love you so much, Teresa. I love you. I told you to stay away from Ethan, didn't I, Teresa? But you don't listen. You never listen. And for that, you're going to pay. I've dreamed about this for so many years. We really are meant for each other. Absolutely. You know, I did always say it was fate. I know you did. You were right. I probably should have listened to you a long time ago. Mm. It's okay. We're together now. Yeah, we are. Mm -hmm. Always. Just, you know, at some moments it's kind of hard to believe. Yeah, well, you better believe it because it's happening. <laughs> We're doing it. That black Mallard, there's nothing that he or she can do to us now. <laughs> you think not? Wait and see. Both my brothers are in prison, and Louise is supposed to be executed. And I just, you know, I don't, I don't know. I just want to help them. What are we going to do? I am going to file an appeal. I promise. And do you think that really would work? I mean, Judge Riley is so afraid of the blackmail. I mean, I don't, I mean well, what if he won't do anything? Teresa, Judge Riley is not the only judge in the country. I mean, I can go to the circuit courts. I can go to Washington if I have to, but I will file an appeal. And that will buy Louise time. Hopefully so. But what we need to concentrate on is finding out who this blackmailer is. That's the only way we're going to prove that your brothers are framed. But once we find this person, we expose them, their power is going to be gone. And that will leave you and me to be free to be together. Important. You fool. 